documentary lovers rejoice. Hey, this is Ray with the Cord Cutters Community, where we are all about helping you cut the cord on cable and satellite TV and still be able to stream your favorite programming. We're here to help with advice, reviews, easy to understand and follow how to's and app overviews like this one right here. Today, we take a first look at the all new Documentary Plus. Nonfiction fans, you now have a new place to get your fix. Documentary Plus is calling itself the best in documentary. And the best part, it's free. And as I always say, if it's free, it's for me. So how is it free? Well, of course it's ad supported, so you're gonna have to see some commercials, but they have said that they might be open to having a paid commercial free version in the future if demand calls for it, but it's not in the plans right now. All right, let's check out their website before we take a first look at the app. All right, here we are on the Documentary Plus website, and I'll have the link below in the description. And the very first thing we see is some of their most popular documentaries here. Cartel Land's a big one, The Imposter. All right, so of course, they start off with the classics Cartel Land, a big, big documentary on the drug war in Mexico. Hype, this is a documentary about the uh, grunge movement in music. I love music documentaries, so I'll be definitely checking that out. And let's uh, scroll through this a little bit and see what else they have here. Life Animated, that's a popular documentary. Street Fight, all right, we're back at the beginning on that section. Okay, Sports. The Stand, No-No, you gotta see No-No. It's an incredible documentary about a guy who threw a no-hitter while he was high on LSD. <laughs> incredible, crazy, crazy documentary. Check that out if you get a chance, okay? If you're a baseball fan, you have to see that. Life Without Basketball, Hitting the Apex. All right, here we are back at the beginning again of that section. Comedy. Meet the Patels. The Aristocrats, Ghost Heads. Kung Fu, all right. Icons. Mystify about Michael Hutchins from In Excess. Okay, and now our music section, some of those uh, are going to be overlapping there. Okay, true crime. And politics. And they have said that they are going to be rotating documentaries so kind of like the way netflix does where some are there for a, a time being and then you know after a few months it leaves and they bring in new new content they plan on doing the same so they did mention they're hoping to get some stuff for the sundance film festival so you might be seeing some new content from that science and nature dolphin lover that is crazy and it is exactly what you're thinking about about a guy who really loves dolphins. Okay, and uh, there's cult documentaries, shorts, and there you go. There's really not too much to their website. Click on films, it's just going to have a lot of the same stuff here. Some of the same stuff we just checked out. And of course, as I mentioned earlier, it is ad supported. And from what I've seen so far, you only see one ad at the beginning before you get into your movies, which is not bad at all. So I'm totally with that, you know, watch you one commercial to help them out and we get our documentaries. All right, now let's try to get Documentary Plus on our device. And Documentary Plus is available on your desktop, iOS, Roku, Apple TV, Fire TV, and Android. Right now, we're going to check it out on the Roku. 
Okay, first of all, of course, we just go to search as always. And then we're going to start typing in Documentary Plus. And I just put in D-O and there it is. Documentary Plus. And we're going to click Add Channel. And while this is adding, well, I'd like to ask you to please give us a like, subscribe, share this with a friend, and of course, click that notification bell so you get notifications every time we upload a brand new video so we can help you on your cord cutting journey, help you save some money, get rid of the high cost of cable satellite, get rid of those contracts. And there we go, pretty much the same as it was on the web. There, right? Let's click one of these here. Let's go with the Michael Hutchins In Excess documentary. Click on watch now. I'm not gonna let it play because I don't want a uh, copyright strike, but I just want to see how long it takes. And as you see up there, it says add one of one. So there's only one commercial. At least that's been my experience so far. So there we go. It loads pretty quick, works pretty nice. And go back to the main screen here. And you have very, very much like the web interface. Let's go to settings and see what is available there. And of course, they have a search section where you can search for your favorite documentaries to see if they have it. And not much going on here in the settings either. I believe that you can sign in and then that will save your place. So you can go from, you know, if you're watching it on one device and then go to another. It'll be saved where you left off. So there it is, a very quick first look at the brand new app, Documentary Plus. Once again, this is Ray with the Cord Cutters community. I'd like to thank you for coming on by. And please give us a like, subscribe, click that notification bell so you get notifications when we upload a new video and share this with a friend. All right, thank you so, so much. And we'll talk to you again real soon. Take care.